what's going on guys um it is the following day after lowering the vehicle and the 235 40s um they clear in the back but in the front they're rubbing a lot so what i did was i went and picked up some i really wanted some 225 40s but i picked up some 215 35 18s uh, and i'm kind of worried and see how thin of a sidewall it's going to be but let's just try one out and see what they look like right now it's rubbing right here on both sides um but we'll see what happens looks good though all right guys thing two because their jack or their lift was too high both of them to clear the car so went home and grabbed my own shit Oh, that's a big difference. The tires, the jack and stuff from the trunk. It looks a lot lower from the back now. And that's what it looks like from the side. The car is sitting way, way lower. Now I'm gonna have to go a little bit lower on the front. And I have plenty, plenty of room now. Plenty of room, so good i'm just gonna go to the car wash later on today get it cleaned up and let y'all see how it looks all cleaned up the car does sit a lot lower now though significantly probably like an inch inch and a half you can tell when you're inside the car but um now we're over here messing with the cooper with the axle that i we had mentioned the other day just got my steelies on the front. What are you doing? What are you doing? I'm trying to get this to drop down. Come on. Come on. so good <laughs> I haven't been in a loud car in a long time <laughs> so uh, if you guys ever need a mess with the Mini Cooper um, crank your wheel all the way to the passenger side and you'll be able to get that control arm way easier off than when it's straight I hit it twice and it popped out and the axles out now and we just can't need to take off what the carrier bearing yeah we gotta take off the, the, the power steering cooling fan after you oh, take no. out the power steering cooling fan, it's uh, it's right there. It's, it should be four bolts that are holding the carrier bearing, and then that 
whole entire, you could slide the whole entire axle out the rest of the way. Seems uh, straightforward. You didn't go up higher or no? Not really, no. Okay. But I also finally picked up my monster mats for the car today. So I'm pretty excited about that. I'll go to the car wash later, wash the rear weather tech, these and the car, throw these in. And we'll be good to go for the night. Cause tonight we're going to a tonight we're going to a European or European car show today. And Austin I got invited to. Um, so we're gonna go check that out and see. Take the car out to our first car, Austin car meet. So that'll be fun. But yeah. So we got the axle taken apart. And uh, meanwhile we were banging over here at the axle this little baby bird fell out of the tree i really don't want to touch it because i know that's when the moms won't get him anymore but i feel like he's grown to where his mom isn't even She's around like everybody else yep old poor tyrone his daddy went to fucking the corner store for some gum and never came back yeah <laughs> i don't know what i'm gonna do I'm gonna feel bad if I just leave it here because I know the cat's gonna get it. Franco. So that is the car all buttoned up now with the new tires and new mats. Um, I'm actually now in Corpus or South Padre. Um, getting away kind of for the weekend um, may or may not film while I'm down here but let me just show you what the car is